Hey, how's it going, everybody? My name is John Hammond. Wanted to crank out the solution for you for the most recent challenge. Real simple, how many people and dogs are at the show if there are 22 heads and 72 feet total? Well, let's crank through this. It's pretty simple if we think it through, for one thing. If we have just people and dogs that we're working with, we also want to know there are a total of 22 heads, right? And there are a total of 72 feet. Well, a person only has one head, and they happen to have two feet. A dog only has one head, and they happen to have four feet, right? Knowing this, we can kind of set up equations for the total number of heads, since we know it's just both the people and dogs are taking, like, part, they're, as part of it, they're factoring in. And the same thing for feet. So if we had heads for that equation, it's pretty much like the coefficients there. One plus number of people, plus one times the number of dogs, it's going to give us 22 heads, right? So it's like the number of people plus the number of dogs. Essentially, x and y variables, that's all it is. And since we have these two equations and these two variables, it's pretty much just a simple uh, system of equations. Same thing works for feet. People, 2 plus people, 2 times people, since people have 2 feet. 4 times dogs, since a dog will have 4 feet, those are equal 72. So all we have to do is have Python solve this, these systems of equations for us. We can do that with the SymPy module. Go ahead and import SymPy. And let's create these symbols for us. Let's say people and dogs equals SymPy.Symbols, people and dogs. And now we can just print out the result of solving that equation. SymPy.Solve, SymPy.EQ. So we want people plus dogs, that equaled 22 in regards to heads. And we have another equation in regards to feet. Oh. We had two feet for each person, and we had four feet for each dog, and that were that was 72 total feet. And since we are solving multiple equations, we'll actually have to throw these in an array or in a list. So just wrap those in braces, and then we're solving for people and dogs. Now when we run this, hey, we get our solution. We had eight people, and we had 14 dogs. Okay, easy enough. That solves it for us. In my book that I'm grabbing all of these logic puzzles from, that is the correct answer. There were eight people and 14 dogs at the show. We just solved that really simply, setting up a, setting up two equations, so really a, sim a system of equations, and then having Python solve that with the SymPy module. Easy enough. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed this. Hope the code that you sent in was pretty similar. See you in a new video.